not sure if he's a shooter or not. He was decent, but we're really more curious what's with him. These guys are still bachelored up, and he was pretty good buck, so we're going to put a little stock on these bucks and see what we can come up with. <laughs> up there I think there's probably six or eight but no shooters nice bull elk we ran into got to stock in on a bunch of them really close great time let's uh, load up and go do it again really dark horned He's beautiful.
while we were driving around and uh, glassing up a few spots for some mule deer and we happened to come across this bad boy and uh, hopped out of the truck and found it. Nice old washed out elk shed but still a nice find. Uh, pretty cool memento. So It's nice as a cameraman to be able to go home with something. I'm getting ready for the evening here and we've been seeing all kinds of deer coming out of these aspens on these hillsides here and we're about halfway up this halfway up the slope and there's some benches it's got deer and elk all through it so hopefully we'll uh we'll see some shooter bucks we've seen some really nice bucks up here but nothing yet that uh has me pull my gun out so we'll uh hopefully get it done tonight we'll see Moose. Oh, no, no. Well, no shooters tonight. We saw a pile of bucks. It was a good day. A pile of elk, a pile of moose. Again, another glorious day in Wyoming. We'll find our shooters. Just gotta keep searching. We are doing moose spaghetti. So we got uh, some moose meat, Randy's moose meat, Shira's moose, mushrooms, onions, a little Montreal seasoning. We got some ragu. It's gonna be perfect. That's good. Good morning. 